Hello again, this is Gabriel from TruePixel and today I'm going to show you how to make an easy cameras setup for your scene in Cinema 4D. Okay, let's say you have finished modeling your scene. You have your sky, you have your floor, you placed your objects, applied textures and materials, uh, you have made your render settings and you are at the point where you want to create images from your scene. How to do that? At first, you need to check your output path, your resolution and file name, just so the program can save automatically the image on your desktop or whatever you want it to be saved. Then it is very easy from the point you're looking at to just click this button here and the rendering happens. How about if you want to make renderings for your scene from more viewing points that you don't want to uh, continuously move around, render, move back and render, and you want those points to be saved, fixed, and to just come back to them whenever you want. For that, we need to create cameras. To create a camera, we go here in the top bar where we have the other tools, and we just click on the camera. If we hold click, on this tab, we see a drop down with more camera types, but we will mainly use the fixed camera, which is the first one. Now we see our camera is here in the list added on top of the other objects in the scene. Please keep in mind that every time you create a new camera, it will appear in the exact same spot you are viewing from, and it will be pointed to the exact spot you are looking at. This means that if we move around our scene, the camera will remain in the exact spot we were when we created it. If we want to go back to see what the camera is seeing right now, you just need to go here in the list and click on this small black marker. Now we are in the camera and we can move anywhere we want and adjust it, have a cool angle for our scene. Also, remember that when you are inside a camera and you move around your object or your scene, the camera moves with you. We exit the camera now, clicking the same marker again. Now the camera is where we left it. Let us now create uh, multiple cameras from the same scene from different points. Let's enter this camera in and adjust it to have a full frontal view of our scene. When we are ready and we know that this is the point we want to render from, we just get out of the camera and now the camera is fixed. To create a new camera from a different angle, we just need to move around the scene where we want to render from and create a new camera. Now, if we enter in the other camera that we created before, it will go back to it. And if we click on the new camera marker, it will go back. This way, we won't lose the points of interest. I will now create two more angles. New camera. And now let's go to the other side. New camera. And now we have four cameras in our scene. We can switch between them by moving from marker to marker. And you are ready to render. Done.
you can create as many cameras as you need for your scene and you can even adjust each of them by clicking this marker let's say you want to move a little bit then you can make your new rendering if you want to change something in your scene let's say move objects or retexture or create new mod models remember to exit the camera so you will not affect its position now you can edit and model further and then when you are ready your cameras are already set you can just switch between them and start rendering i hope you enjoyed this small video with camera setup tips make sure you subscribe to my channel activate the notifications and wait for the next cool videos to see what's up